Magicians have always stayed ahead of the technology curve. Their illusions accomplish what technology cannot. But what happens when the technology of the day seems almost magical? What happens when you can do this? A hundred years ago, that would have been the magic of levitation. Is it possible to create illusions in a world where technology makes anything possible? Stay. If you know how the trick is done, where is the illusion? Here, boy. He can do a trick. Watch. Up. Hey, where are you going? I think there's more to this than meets the eye. Come back. Very funny. Behave yourselves. As a magician, I've always known that the illusion is in the mind of the beholder. Once upon a time, this would have been magic. Today, it is a trick of technology. But still, our imagination is more powerful than our reasoning. And it's easy to attribute personality to machines. They are quadcopters, designed by Daito Manabe and Motoi Shiboshi and their team at Rhizomatics Research here in Tokyo. They are more than mechanical flying machines. They analyze the environment around them and react to everything I do. Advanced algorithms allow these autonomous machines to fly in close formation, aware of each other, aware of me. Mathematics? that can be mistaken for intelligence, and intelligence for personality, anthropomorphism. That's the illusion. An illusion created by technology and embroidered by our imagination to become an intelligent flying robot, a machine that appears to be alive. I think they said hello. Now we have one final trick to show you. Get ready, guys. That's it. Thanks for watching. We'll see you around. Bye bye. <laughs>